Hello everyone, welcome to study time. In this video we are going to see class 1 max chapter 1 KV CBSE or NCRT syllabus shapes and space inside outside. What is shapes? So square, circle, triangle, a rectangle these are shapes. What is space? The hollow thing inside it is called space. Shall we move into the lesson? Yes. The Arab and his camel. It was a cold winter day. The Arab was traveling on the camel back. At night the Arab pitched his tent and went inside it. The camel was outside. The, this is Arab. Wherever you see this picture, it is Arab. And wherever see you see this picture, it is camel. It was cold day. What is cold? Cool. The Arab was traveling on camel back. The Arab could not tra uh, walk for a long distance. So, he is tra uh, traveling on back of camel. At night, so he cannot walk... Uh, during night which will be very dark outside so he decided to stay at that time he built his own tent and went inside it the camel stayed outside we'll see what happens after that so may i put my neck inside it was too cold outside the camel felt very cold outside so it is asking the Arab may I put my neck inside the Arab says okay you may put your neck inside the Arab says you can you may put your neck inside so next what is uh, this camel say camel again camel is again feeling very cold outside so it is again asking may I put my front legs inside so the Arab is asking, okay, you might put your friend leg inside. So Arab gives permission to put his friend legs. Next, camel is asking, can I come inside? It was too cold outside. So again, the camel is feeling very cold and it is asking, can I come inside? The Arab says, oh no, the tent is too small for both of us. The Arab says that the tent is, tent is very small for both of them to stay. So what does uh, this camel do? Camel came inside. So it is saying I am coming inside and you go outside. And the uh, Arab is staying outside. See this Arab is staying outside. Camel is sleeping inside. So this is a picture of camel, Arab and tent. Next, bigger, smaller. What is bigger? See, this is this is one small triangle. This is big. So when you compare two pictures, we say bigger, smaller. So this is small one. This is bigger one. Okay, we'll see which is bigger and which is smaller. Tick the bigger. So I am going to tick the bigger which is big here. Hippopotamus is big. So I am I have put a tick mark in hippopotamus. Next tick the smaller. Which is smaller here? This leaf is smaller. And this animal is smaller than cow. This is squirrel. Squirrel is smaller than cow. Next. Tick the small tire. Which is small tire here. This is smaller tire. Next. Biggest, smallest. Here we are going to compare more than two. So we say bigger, biggest and smallest. Take the smallest tree. So this is smallest tree. Next. Take the biggest animal. Which is biggest here? Puppy, kitten or Elephant biggest is elephant is biggest. Next, 
take the smallest fruit here this plum is the smallest fruit take the biggest bubble this is biggest bubble shall we move on to next yes next top bottom what is top bottom here this boy is playing on the top this boy is bottom this bird is on the top this animal is on the bottom tick the pot on the top so which is the pot on the top this is the pot on the top tick the animal at the bottom of the stairs so which is on the bottom of the stairs next nearer father tick the bird nearer to home which is nearer to home this is the bird nearer to home tick the cat farther from the tree so this is the cat which is farther from the tree next nearest fathers so this is a swing this boy is nearest to the swing and this girl is farthest from the swing tick the puppy farthest from the tree so this is the puppy which is at very far distance from the tree tick the tree nearest to the bird so this is the bird this tree is nearest to the bird next on and above below suppose if an object is placed very near we say on and if it is placed at some distance we say above below we'll see what is it see this cat is on the table because it is touching the table and it is very near to the surface this mouse is under the table because it is also touching the table this fan is above the table we say above because it is present at a distance from the table this boy is below the fan because he is present at a distance from the fan so we say above below on under based on where it is present next discuss near far top bottom we'll see what is near what is far what is where which is at the top and bottom in this picture see this part is near the well and this boy is far from the well this bird is on the top of well and this boy is below the tree next we'll discuss shapes around us put the shapes in the pink and yellow boxes by drawing a line so if it is square shaped we'll place it in this if it is round shape we'll place it in yellow color we'll see see this chalk should be placed in pink color this box should be placed in pink color this also should be in pink color whereas balloon tomato orange and ball should be placed in yellow color next match the similar shapes by drawing a line see this shape and this chalk box is similar this ball and this is similar this tomato and balloon is similar 
so we'll we'll complete part 1 of chapter 1 maths with this we'll see the remaining part in part 2 video i'll give the description i'll give the link in the description box thank you